Hi everyone, Stiffy from GRM here. In today's episode of our S5000 tech videos, we're going to be talking about electronics. So with the electronics for the S5000 cars, our design brief was to, to keep it as, as simple and, and low cost as possible while maximising the reliability where we can. As a template for the electronics in the S5000, we looked at Porsche Carrera Cup to see what sensors and electronics were required to, to run a race category. So as with the, the rest of the 5000, our design brief was to again showcase Australian manufacturing and, and design work. So for the electronics package, the hardware is supplied by Motec for ECU, PDM, DASH and data logger. The, the looms themselves, wiring looms, are designed here in-house by GRM uh, and then made absolute gorgeous looms by Ryan Corley at ProLoom uh, in Richmond, Melbourne um, and engine looms by uh, Chris Archer up in Queensland. Again, looking for something that's, that's going to run for years without any issues and provide a really cost-effective solution for the category. Obviously what the, the drivers are going to be looking at and focused on, um, and probably the only visible part of the, the electronics is the steering wheel. Um, so we've done a, a custom design steering wheel here at GRM to make sure it fits nicely with the tub and also our requirements from a aesthetic point of view and allowed us to put a fair bit of customization into it. We did this for a couple of reasons, mainly to make sure we get the functionality that we want um, with the, the MoTeC dash and shift light module um, and also the, the critical switches that you need to, to run one of these race cars. So with everything happening here at GRM, obviously building 14 cars, um, the scale of things is something that we haven't really dealt with before. So just to give you guys an example, the handles here are 3D printed in-house. There's obviously 14 steering wheels and that was 28 days of printer time. So when you start adding that to, to every part on the car, you can just see the volume of work that's going on here. So with the philosophy of the S5000 being a controlled category, it was really important from an electronics point of view that the engine map and, and everything was identical between the cars to produce the same power. So from that point, the teams running the cars won't have access uh, to the ECU. Again, in an effort to keep costs down as well. Um, however, the, the dash data is available to, to analyse all the driver inputs and to get the most out of the driver. Because obviously with this class, we want the racing to be hard and the difference to come from the drivers. Oh. 